So hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another Kerbal Data Labs video. You're probably wondering where did I go? <laughs> what happened? And two things happened. The first one was the holidays, so I post the videos on both channels. And the second one was the lack of updates on Charticulator side. Here's the thing, I was using that channel for creating tutorials around Charticulator but because they were not updating it, I was like a little bit suspicious that maybe they were not supporting it anymore. And after some questions here and there, they finally, Microsoft finally answered and said that Charticulator is going to be, this has been discontinued, not it's going to be. So no investments, no updates, no, not even bug fixes, nothing. So it's just dead. So, I don't want to promote a product that is not supported. It would make zero sense. It was actually fun when it lasted. I learned a lot about data visualization just because the way Charticulator build charts. If it was supported, I would be all over the place with it. I thought it was a wonderful tool, but they are not supporting it and yeah if they don't support it this uh, I won't support it either because I would be fooling you into a product that is going to die at some point so I've been thinking like what should I do with this channel and I'm actually substituting Charticulator with Python so I'm learning Python and my Python has a library called matplotlib that is fantastic the downside is that you have to code. I really like the Charticulator user interface like thing. But the upside is that because you code, you can do anything. Like seriously, you, you can do absolutely anything. I have tried visualizations that I was not able to create with, obviously, Power BI, but not Charticulator either, mainly because of the bugs, to be fair. And I've, I've been able to create them. I, I haven't been limited at all. Obviously, I'm limited for my own knowledge, which is very little at the moment, but I haven't been limited at all on what can be done. So I was thinking, well, I could do, you know, the um, a tutorial on Matplotlib in this channel, uh, but then I wonder, like, maybe there are other people on my main channel that would like to learn Python and Matplotlib and, you know, you need a little bit of pandas and a little bit of NumPy. So I ask you and you told me that you do on the main channel want to see those videos. So I am going to do the Matplotlib and Python videos on the main channel, at least for now, to see how it goes. And it leaves me with, I'm not sure what I'm going to post here. So I, I'm not sure. I, I have to think about it. I have to think uh, what content would fit here. If you have any ideas, just let me know. I'm open for suggestions. And uh, yeah, I thought that you, I owed you an, you know, an explanation as to what is going on with the channel. I'm still not sure what I'm going to do with it. Uh, but hopefully I'll figure it out. I'm quite certain that something will pop up that said, this is perfect for this channel. Um, I'm going to leave the Charticulator videos up for now, but I am quite tempted to, you know, put but in private mode to not incentivate using a product that has been discontinued, if that makes sense. Um, but let me know in the comment box. If you want me to keep them up, I of course will keep them up, but bear in mind that the product is now dead. Obviously it can be community developed and I know that the original developers might do some work on it. And that could be like a, you know, exit on how to use Charticulator, but I'm not sure, I just, I don't know exactly how they're planning to develop, if they are planning to develop it. So. We'll see, <laughs> time will tell. But I will do the 
you know, the mad plot live on the main channel. If that doesn't go well there, I'll move it definitely here so we can have it. But if you want to learn Python and Matplotlib, for now, join me on the channel. And again, I, we will see. We will see what we do with this channel. Like, I'm not sure, but if you have any ideas, let me know. Okay, so that's all, and I hopefully see you soon.